Welcome to the Grad Ireland Career Discovery Week podcast. My name is Rory Kavna, editor with Grad Ireland. In this series, we showcase the work, study and career development opportunities available with some of the employers and course providers who are featuring in the Grad Ireland Career Discovery Week. Hi, uh, welcome to the Grad Ireland Career Discovery Week podcast. For this episode, I'd like to welcome John Kyo, who's an area manager with Unpust in the Mails and Parcels Division, and he's joined us here to talk about Unpust ongoing evolution as a business and some of the graduate opportunities within it in terms of how they can evolve into exciting and rewarding career paths. John, thanks for joining us today. Thank you, Rory, for inviting me. No problem, pleasure to have you here. Um, John, I suppose, like, when we think about uh, on post, it's been on quite a journey uh, over the last um, number of years. Can you give us an idea of, this, of the scale of on post now as an organisation? Well, employees, we have in excess of 9,000 people working across the business. We have 1,500 of these working in three mail centres. These mail centres have sophisticated uh, optical ca- character technology. It reads the addresses on letters and parcels and automatically uh, sorts them along conveyor belts, eventually to our fleet of trucks for onward delivery into what we call delivery service units. There are 100, 114 of these delivery service units where our 5,000 post people attend from 6 a.m. every morning, where they collect and sort and organize the mail for their routes. Daily, we deliver approximately 2 million letters and over 200,000 parcels. I suppose on post have the largest fleet in Ireland, and we're currently in the process of moving to uh, electric vehicles. Uh, We have, between the canals in Dublin, already all electric, and by the end of the year, we'll have the cities of Cork, Galway, Limerick, Waterford, Kilkenny, all with electric vehicles. We have a retail business where we are uh, finding great growth in financial services. And posts have over 940 post offices, the largest retail network in Ireland. We're part of every community in Ireland uh, today. Our, our new world, we see it as clicks and mortar approach to business, where we have digital and our post office buildings. We're opening channels where people can do all their post office business online on onpost.com. Besides the two businesses of on post mails and parcels and uh, on post retail, we have a thousand staff who work in the BPO on O'Connell Street and other regional offices in Cork, Nace, Galway. So our finance, IT, marketing, HR, other support functions are based in these locations. Now, corporate social responsibility is a pivotal role for on post um, in order to manage and develop or long-term sustainability. Core po- purpose is to act for the common good, uh, improving the lives of people in Ireland now and for generations to come. Our strategy is evolving all the time. We have programs like literacy, addresses for homeless citizens, work in delivering the five uh, UN Sustainable Development Goals. That's the journey that we're on and that's the scale and size of our business worry. As well, like when you think about the areas of, you've mentioned them there, the clicks and bricks, which is a good way of putting it, as you know, the majority of business continues to probably migrate online, but obviously you still have a large physical presence. What are the areas where a lot of the career paths may be leading towards in the next few years? I suppose to support the automation of our parcel processing and redesigning of our delivery and transport networks, engineering is a a big area. We will need graduates from engineering disciplines uh, to to support our business there. Business analysts is an area that is becoming more and more important uh, with data. We need to help understand and develop the metrics to manage our performance. Uh, Marketeers, as we shift from being an operations-led to a marketing-led business, We need to tell people about our new products and attract new customers, both in financial services and in mails and parcels. Digital analysts, as we move to digital, we support our customers online, develop new services. There's great opportunity there for digital analysts. IT professionals to support uh, retail and delivery networks. Finally, I see environmental scientists as being huge for the future as we work towards the achievement of the five sustainable goals that I mentioned already. And um, as you've highlighted there, 
there's quite a broad range of, of skills. Are there any particular backgrounds that, I mean, you've, you've highlighted obviously some particular skills, which would be obvious tied to particular degrees, but are there any particular career backgrounds, graduate backgrounds that are most suited to some of the roles that you've highlighted, or are you open to people from all from a wide variety of backgrounds? The people who have their academic experience, academic qualifications, who align with our vision and our goals. You know, in the financial services, we like to think we're human about money. And if there's people who, say, digital analysts, as I mentioned, can help to develop the digital side of our financial business to be human about money, they're the type of people that we'd like to attract. On my side of the business, in the mails and parcels, we see ourselves as being the backbone of e-commerce. And we want to get engineers who want to be a part of this exciting future that we have. The marketeers attracts our customers to come to us. What were some of the misconceptions people may have about an organization like on Post? There's been such a transformation in the last three years in particular on our journey from the old world of letters the new world of e-commerce and financial services. I suppose it's important that they have knowledge of that transformation uh, in order to help transformation uh, gather pace and to, to move on. And of course, we are, we are central to every community in the country. We've shown that during the COVID emergency over the last 100 days. And um, I, I think if people would like to be part of an organization, that uh, has a community spirit and is also moving into the future. Uh, graduates in the disciplines that I mentioned are the people that we'd like to bring to the organization. And in terms of the perspectives that graduates can bring to a company like Unfust, uh, a large organization like that, you know, I, I, there's a lot of people there obviously with a lot of experience in many years. They've, they've been part of this evolution. You know, how beneficial is it to have injections of, you know, enthusiasm and perspectives from graduates? Graduate talent is critical to help us with the transition into our new world. Our graduates that we have at the moment and that we've had in, in previous years, they've found that they're getting real projects to work on. They have access to senior managers, um, as well as managers at all level, and uh, they're getting both fantastic on-the-job development opportunities, as well as participating in the professional graduate development program with graduates from other companies that's done through the IMI, the Irish Management Institute. And, uh, you know, for students who want to take the next step, as in they wanted to investigate the sort of opportunities that were there, what would be the next step they should take? If they'd visit uh, onpost.com, there's graduate videos online that they can watch, and the experiences of these graduates will show prospective new graduates that would like to join us, what it's like to work with us, and... Uh, consider on post as your employer for your career. From your own personal experience, would you be working with people from who came through the graduate program? The, the managing director of our mails and parcels business, my boss, Garrett Bridgman, uh, came through as a graduate 20 odd years ago. He progressed nice through roles both in sales and marketing operations and to managing director. So there, I've worked with many uh, people who are now managers in Unpost who came in through the graduate program in engineering, HR, etc. They're a bit older now, but they're wiser and uh, they have been good for the organization. And I think the organization has been good for them. Excellent. Well, I think that's a nice way to wrap it up. So uh, I'd like to thank J John Kyo for joining us here today on the Grad Island Career Discovery Week podcast. Um, we really appreciate your time, John, and providing such insights into working in an organisation such as Uh Thank you very much, Rory, and 